welcome back to another video you guys today is gonna be an interesting video because i am impulsively dyeing my hair yes this is real random and i'm actually bored so i want a new look and i'm at a stage right now now i'm not i'm not really feeling myself so i'm just like why not just do this because i bought dye i bought a two box of dyes like weeks ago and it's like i was hesitating to do this because it's like it's, since it's a brighter color i'm just like mm, am i gonna look nice and i normally do dye my hair but it's not too bright you feel me it's not like really too light of a color but i'm doing like a light bronze you feel me so i'm a bit scared like but we're gonna do it because summer's slowly approaching new look for myself i just want to feel myself again because i'm not really feeling myself and i'm sorry to be coming you guys looking real crazy you feel me i look crazy most of the time but just know your girl pops up okay like i'll be looking good you feel me but other than that i gotta go take my braids out it looks a bit embarrassing like i'm not gonna show you guys because that look bad it don't even look braids it look like it's just it's just i don't know it look it look like a ponytail but it's braids but let me go take those braids out before we get into this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe all right your girl is back i took the braids off and guys i'm like regretting this halfway through because this is the color that i'm going for while editing this i'm just realizing how chopped i look please guys don't judge me don't worry about how i look it's just it's just funny like just look at that <laughs> and this is really light like this typically this is the color that i'm going for i don't know i hope it's that because i do not want to go lighter like i just don't know how to style my hair and it's like ever since i cut my hair i've just been doing wigs and braids i really don't know i don't like the little ponytails but i can pull it together like i have a fat face so if i'm doing do if i'm gonna do a small ponytail i have to put lashes on i have to put my face together because no 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 small ponytails is not it <laughs> is that it so like I'm, I'm not i'm not sure like if i will look nice with this because my hair is short I had to do a big chop because my hair was damaged, it was finito, so, you know, I have to do the whole regrowing process again. So, basically, my hair is black, but it's brown at the ends because I did dye my hair. So, the color is going to be much brighter here than my roots, but I have to section my hair actually in four parts. I'm not going to do this evenly. I'm just spontaneously just parting my hair. I don't really care. It could just do whatever. Like, as long as it looks nice in the front, that's what it's what it's about, right? <laughs> Period. All right, so I just like put my hair into four into a part. I think I'm gonna do another part along here because I have to do like a full part thing. This is for some reason my stomach is moving kind of crazy because I'm scared. I'm scared. But we're just gonna do it, okay? But look how small my ponytail is. I used to have hair, but it's like... That's what it is. But it's look like a clean... Don't zoom in, because I got danger off my scalp. So I actually waited for my hair to get dirty so that, for some reason, I don't know if it's true, like, I guess it is. It's like, when your hair is dirty and you're dying your hair, it grabs the color. I guess it does. I do wait for like my hair to get a little bit low, so I do my hair and it's, and it do look good. At the end result, it looks good. Oh, this is a clean part. Period. Don't play with me. Where's my rubber band? Where did I put my rubber band? I just, <laughs> it's on, it's, I, moving on to the next step. It's like, why do they tape up the box this much? Like. Yeah, we're not gonna steal the product, okay? So I'm actually kind of glad that I cut my hair because my hair was at a point where it's like, baby girl, like, your hair is not gonna grow if you don't cut it. And it's been like that for years, so I'm just like, yeah. And everyone's just been telling me like, oh, you gotta cut your hair or your hair's not gonna grow. Like, every time I go to the hair salon, I'm like, no, 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 I don't wanna, I don't wanna cut, I want it, I want it like this, the life that it is. But they're like, your hair's not gonna grow. 
because I've been doing a lot of searching. Wait, hold up. So this is basically a high lift booster for blond um, blonding powder for lightest blonde. Just say it's bleach, all right? Like, I'm finna bleach my hair. I did not know that. Is it bleach? Is it? I don't know. I really don't know. I'm so scared now, now that I've seen this. They could've just put it in the product. I would not never knew, but now I know. Like, I'm scared, I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna look, but it is what it is. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is how the products look basically I don't know let me read the directions because I'm like that person that just doesn't read it and just try to do it on my own but you have to read instructions I have so much gloves like I'm always perming dyeing my hair so there's mad gloves like I have so many pairs all right so I ended up mixing all the products inside the developer and it's like the Highland Booster Powder, I don't think I'm going to put everything in there because I'm not going that light. This is like my first time doing like a blonde color, so I'm not really going like a light tone. I'm just going like almost like a dark blonde, if you get what I mean. And anyways, like the expectation that they gave me on the box that I was supposed to go for is almost like a dark, a dark blonde. And it better. It better be giving that because I don't want to be blonde. I don't want to be a blonde blonde. But it's a lot of powder. They gave me, ooh. They gave me so much powder in here. It's like a lot left. And it's like two packs. So yeah, I'm not doing it. I gotta stop complaining and do it. Who knows? This is gonna be real good. Like, I'm probably gonna love it. Like, I'm dragging it. Like, I'm always dragging things. Always dragging it. But I'm gonna apply this in my hair. All right. So I plan on doing like the first part. Like, I know I'm gonna need help in the back. But let me part this side. So that I'm able to capture the front like because you know the front part is all what it matters like the back I don't give a shit you know what I mean I really don't all right here we go what's when I apply it it's not going back and guys I'm on this part like it's very thin here I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it that's it all right let me apply it so that I can hurry up. I can't believe I'm doing it. I can't believe I'm doing it. This is bizarre. It's not like burning already. Cause for some reason, every time I apply dye, it burns, like it burns. And I guess it burns because like my hair is not clean. What the freak? Come out. Next bottle, because you just waste my time right now. There we go. Alright. I ended up putting the products on my head. As you can see, it's starting to get really light. And it's like, hmm, I think I'm going for the color that I always go for when I dye my hair. Like, it's been so hard for me to get a lighter tone, but it is what it is like, at this point. But I can see my roots changing color. Like, it's changing color real fast. And I gotta get the back. So, the camera's about to die. I'm about to finish it off. And I'll see you guys when I wash off my hair. All right, so I ended up doing my hair. I have it into a curly fro, so that's why my bonnet look a bit puffy. But I do want to do my makeup because this is a bit a transformation for myself, and I do want to surprise you guys, just give y'all guys the full, the full glam. But guys, I ended up loving the results. Actually, when I first washed it off, I was like, mm, I'm not really feeling it. I felt like it was too bright or too like ginger, gingerish. But it's cute. It's cute. I had to give myself some time to uh um to able to like the color. It's been like days later, so I'm now feeling the color. It's cute. I'm sorry earlier. I'm just not noticing how crusty my lips were. It was bad. Don't mind. 
and I'm gonna do my makeup. This is not a tutorial. Don't judge me. So enjoy the entertainment. I did not eat breakfast at all. I mean, a full cup of watermelon with sugar. And you know what's crazy? When I washed off my hair, my mom was so surprised. I was so scared for my mom's reaction. For some reason, anything that I do, I'm just so scared of my mom's reaction because I just don't know how she's going to react. She ended up loving the results. She was like, oh my gosh, you look so nice. You look like a whole different person. It fits you, stay with it. So her saying that, it really actually built up my confidence with the color. At first I was like, oh no, let me go on Amazon. Let me order me a, a black um, hair dye so that I can go back. I don't want to do this anymore. But my siblings, oh, my sister told me, my niece told me, so I'm just like, you know what? I'm gonna stay with the color. It looks cute. Ugh. I have no eyebrows. Like at the end, it's sh shaved. I bought my outfit. This is from H and M. It's cute. It has like cute ties. And this bralette. I don't even know where I got this bralette. But this bralette is so cute. I forgot. Like you know how you just get something and it's just like you definitely forget, you forget the store or it's not even around anymore. So this eyebrow ended up shaping better than this one. This is why I say this is not a tutorial. It's not. I'm gonna apply my foundation. I'm not gonna put any primer since I'm not really going anywhere. Oh yeah, by the way, I use Fenty for my foundation and my concealer. I don't know if you guys could notice, but the foundation looks a bit dark. I don't know if I should apply more because I barely could see it. So I'm gonna slide this back a little bit. You guys probably could see my edges already. I gotta get my forehead though. Ooh. I'm finished with my look for some weird reason my camera didn't capture anything but I went for a neutral look I love the neutral look I always go for a neutral look and I just don't like going too glammed out I only go glammed out when it's like a big occasion or like when it's my birthday all right now I'm about to apply the lashes it's these cute mink lashes like I love mink lashes they're so cute just now I'm about to go in with the mascara on my bottom lashes this is the full look now. I love it. It's very natural, very calm, you know, cute, calm, collective. I'm gonna go do my hair, style it for you guys, then surprise you guys from there. All right, yeah, girl, it's finally done. I'm ready to show you guys the result. Are you guys ready? This is the result. I am in love with the result i love it it brings me out much more it definitely go with my skin complexion i love the color it's more like a ginger color i would say i look like beyonce but i'm not gonna go too far with it this is the color that i was going for not too light not too dark but this is what it is if you guys ever thinking of dyeing your hair go for it don't be scared especially if you're getting out of a breakup go for it I'm just in love with the results. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.